So in this lab, we're going to be looking at different factors that affect how fast a reaction will proceed. So just to set up, we have our distilled water, and we have our 0.2 molar solution of sodium thiosulfate, and our 2 molar solution of hydrochloric acid. So we're going to be starting um, not with the 45 milliliters of sodium thiosulfate, but with the 40 milliliters. So we'll measure out in a graduated cylinder 40 milliliters of our 0.2 molar sodium thiosulfate. and pour it into our flask. And then using a different graduated cylinder, we can measure out five milliliters of our distilled water. And as soon as we add that to our flask, we have to start timing. So set our time to zero. We swirl the flask once or twice, and then wait until we can no longer see the cross. And that was 16 seconds. So we record our start and end time. And then we can proceed doing the same procedure with the different concentrations and different volumes.